Welcome to our data science tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many Python enthusiasts encounter when working with Pandas data frames. Our viewer is curious about how to create multiple rows at once using the dot lock method. Let's dive into the details. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you get through that resolution. So let's continue on. Let's start by reviewing how we can create a new row in a pandas data frame using the dot lock method. As you can see, we successfully added a new row with index three. However, if we want to add multiple rows at once, we need to ensure that the indices we use are not already present in the data frame. If we try to execute this code, we encounter a key error because the indices four and five do not exist yet. To add multiple rows without using dot append, we can assign values directly to the data frame. To create new rows, we can first expand the data frame by re-indexing it. This allows us to add the new indices before assigning values. Now let's check the data frame. We should see the new rows added successfully with the specified values. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Let's explore how to create multiple rows in a pandas data frame using the dot lock method. First, we have some example data with three columns, A, B, and ID. In case one, we use a loop to set the first 10 rows of column A to 30. Notice how the data frame expands to accommodate the new values. In case two, we add a new column C to the data frame. As we extend it to 10 rows, the existing columns fill with NN for the new rows. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped find that solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.